we're gonna draw this pier. The step one, uh, we're gonna mark where we're gonna place uh, the objects, right? That's the top. Let me see, maybe this is the bottom. And maybe this is the left. <laughs> this is the right. Okay, so we're not sure. Either can, no, this is too high. So I am going to move it a little lower here and then the bottom, so over here. And then the left over here, okay. And the right, maybe over here. Yeah, this is, would be fine. We're not quite sure at this point. So I'm gonna draw a little line, just a straight line to, to feel if this is what we want, okay? Use a straight line is easier because you don't want to look at too much of the detail. At this point, we need to measure. I have my arm stretch, and then let me see. I'm gonna first take the lap and then rotate it from here to the top. I compare the width to the height. Actually, the height just a little bit more than the width. And actually right here, this is the width. Because I take the width and rotate it, and I measure compared to the width to the height. It's close to the height. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this, right? That's how we measure. Rotate it, uh, obviously. This is not really wide enough. So I'm gonna mark this as the right. And this is the left. Okay, so I'm gonna put this, move it a little bit more to the left. Down here. And that's the bottom. And this is the right. Oh, the right need to be more here. Okay, like this. Okay. This is the right. I don't want you to use the eraser so early. We don't need to use the eraser to draw the Y shape now at this point. Okay. Good. Now we have the outline for the pier and we already measure the proportion between the width and the height. Up here, that is just the stem of the pier. Okay. I'm also going to have uh, outline the uh, the catch the shadow is about here. Okay, it's about over here. So next, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna blend in the the whole shape. What we're gonna try to do, we are apply some pencil mark uh, in this area so that I can start blend the value. Okay, I'm also gonna apply some to the catch the shadow. So what's the next step? The next step is blending. Here's the blender. Okay, let's see. Here you go. It's called the middle tone. The middle tone. Let's get. Now we have like a gray paper in the middle of the shape. Next, I'm gonna use the eraser to pick up the highlight. So you are setting up the tone, it's the middle tone, and then you use the uh, eraser to create the light shape. Okay. And what about some dark area? What can we do? The dark area, you're gonna use the pencil to make it darker. So I can see in this area, from here and to the right, look a little bit darker. So I'm going to make it darker here. Apply another layer of pencil. Now darker. Okay. This is darker now on the right side. And we're gonna blend it together too. Use the blender. So blend it now. On this side, called shadow side, it's now look darker uh, than the light side, okay? What about in the catch the shadow? And the catch the shadow, 
and also have an area much darker. Okay, here. Because since the table is flat, so we're just going to use the straight line. Like this. Okay, this is dark. I'm going to use the blender. Also blend it in. Okay. Now it's much softer. I'm going to make this side a little bit lighter because it has the reflected light here. We use the eraser too. The eraser can make that area a little bit lighter and also remains pretty soft, right? Lighter still. That's good. Right? Have a little light here too. There's some detail we need to add to the drawing on the top over here. And this side looks like a cylinder. So you are drawing this and the has shadow side look darker and a little cast the shadow on here a little darker and here have a little bit darker those are the detail that you should uh, work on it after you control the big area if you want this a little bit lighter just use the, the eraser to make it lighter I'm gonna clean up uh, the outside area Okay, I'm gonna, that's a little rough, so I'm gonna brand that again. Make it a little smoother. Okay. That's the highlight. We're gonna keep that. And we probably also make that, this a little bit lighter. The last step is final touch. Making sure you can correct anything that's not right. Okay, and the darkest area at the bottom over here, I'm going to use the pencil to add that to the drawing. Okay, that's really dark, that's good. Put it up here. And you can add a little dot to the drawing. Because that is just the skin uh, of the pier. You can add the dot, but you don't want to add the dot at the beginning. We only add it when it's the last thing. I think down here, I also need a little bit lighter down here. I'm gonna reflect it. 